it's Tara from Butterfly Candy. I hope you guys had a wonderful, wonderful holiday season. I hope you got lots of goodies for you and your dolls and other toys for Christmas. Today I wanted to design a Create Your Own doll on the American Girl website through the Create Your Own portion of it. And then at the end I want to show you how she turned out. So let's get started. Here is the American Girl website where you can go here to create your own doll. Alright, so you have these two choices. You can either create a doll, you'd click start here, or you can design a one-of-a-kind fashion. So like a custom t-shirt, dress, that kind of thing is on the right side. But today we are going to create a doll. It doesn't really matter what doll you start with. You can change any of the features once you've selected a doll. So we're going to start with this one. So you click Create Yours. Then it has kind of like a tutorial where it will walk you through, but we're just going to skip that. Alright, so she's looking pretty cute already, but I'm going to change her a little bit. So let's start with hair. And don't forget you can do a hairstyle and you can do a barrette, you could do a double ponytail or you could do pigtails. We're going to select none for this doll. For the haircut, I really want long hair. I really like this one. Um, let's see. There's some really pretty choices here. But I really want long hair. So I either want this one or this one. So this one's called Natural Long. And this one is called Long Wavy. I'm going to go with the Long Wavy. And then we have choices for hair color. Ooh, I really like the dark brown. I'm going to select the light brown. It's just called brown, but I call it light brown because they have dark brown. And this one is the lighter of the two. Alright, so we've selected the haircut and the hair color. Let's go to facial features. They have five different facial features. A is the classic mold, so that's going to be like Samantha. B is the Josefina mold, so that'll be like the doll Josefina. C is the Jess mold, so that's going to be like Kanani. Um, I'm trying to think who else has the Jess mold, besides Jess, of course. So that is that one. And then this one, D, is the Sonali face mold. And I believe Melody, yep, Melody also has the D face mold, so if you like Melody's face, that would be that one. And then E is the Addy face mold. My favorite by far is the Jess mold. I've always been a huge fan of the Jess mold. Then you get three different skin tone choices. There is the light, the medium, and the dark. I'm going to select the medium for this doll. Alright, let's select the eye color. Ooh, look at all these pretty choices. Ooh, the blue is really pretty on her. We have light blue. Hazel's probably my favorite. I really like the gray like Molly had. Do you remember that? Ooh, brown looks really pretty on her too, but we're going to go with Hazel. And we do want freckles, um, we do not want braces, and we do not want hearing aids. So we're done on the face. And then we get to choose her outfit. There are five different options for outfits. I really like this one. This one's called Let's Daydream. And I also really like the Let's Smile. I I think I'm gonna go with the Let's Smile one. And here are the accessories. 
Ooh, I really like this lime purse. Oh, and you get a little smoothie. Awesome. Here's the Let's Play accessories, the Let's Smile accessories, which is the match for the outfit that I picked. Uh, let's daydream. I really like this purse. Let's celebrate. So my favorite is the Let's Smile. Plus it goes really well with the outfit I've selected for her. So we'll go with that one. You want to make sure to add glasses since it is included in the price. Ooh, those look really nice. The brown ombre. Then we have glitter, raspberry, striped, turquoise, and... Oh, no, that was tortoise. And then we have turquoise. I think I'm going to go with the raspberry ones. And then we definitely want to pierce her ears because that's also included with this purchase. So there she is. Isn't she beautiful? There is some back order information that will show up on the bottom. Alright guys, so that is the complete creation portion of it. And so now, are you excited? She has arrived and we're going to open her! Alright, so here she is. I'm so excited. This took four, that's right, four months to receive her because uh, her face mold was on back order. But I'm so excited to have her here and I can't wait to share her with you. And this box is so beautiful. It has this beautiful ribbon on the side. All right, let's take a first look at her. There she is. Isn't she beautiful? Oh my goodness. She has the Jess face mold in the medium skin tone, although it's very bright in here, so it looks a little bit lighter than it really is. She has hazel eyes, which I think are very green. She has beautiful freckles. I really like how they turned out. Here's her outfit. All right, let's get her out of the box. At the very bottom of the box is where all of the accessories are, so I will open those up last. Here she is out of the box. Isn't she just super, super cute? Oh my goodness, let's get the wig cap off so we can see her long, beautiful hair. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that hair. Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. So here is a faux pocket detailing and also some little buttons and they are faux buttons. They don't actually button. Um, nice little collar. Nice sleeves. Here's the back. And that's what the dress looks like without the jacket. Very pretty. And then here's the shoes. And then one of the things for the Create Your Own Dolls is their foot is stamped. I think it's just one foot. Yep, just one foot is stamped with one of a kind. She does have her ears pierced. That's something you want to uh, remember when doing the doll is to get the ears pierced because there's no extra cost for the Create Your Own. Here is the body. Um, I think it looks just the same as the other dolls. I really like the shape. Very nice bodies on them. She did come with cute little pink removable underwear. Here is a closer look at the dress. Very cute. So now let's take a look at the accessories. All right, I made sure to get a cute pair of glasses. I think these glasses will look really cute on her. It also comes with this adorable coffee. Oh my goodness, look how cute this is. It says Hot Cocoa American Girl Cafe. And when you open the lid, it has a little heart 
All right, she also came with a purse, a butterfly necklace, a butterfly notepad, a tiny little pencil, very pretty. All right guys, so that's my new Create Your Own Doll from American Girl. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you have name suggestions, let me know in the comments down below. I really enjoyed making her and I'm really glad that she arrived all safe and sound after four months. Um, there is one difference I really wanted to mention as well is that she doesn't smell the same as my other American Girl dolls did when they were new. Um, it still smells like like a fact. It does have like a factory smell to it, and it's not a bad smell in any way. It just doesn't have that typical American Girl smell that I am used to. So that's just something to keep in mind that I found different about them. Overall, I'm really really happy with her quality. I think it's on point. I was a little bit scared because of some of the posts I had seen on Facebook. But mine looks beautiful, she doesn't have any problems that I could find, and I really hope you enjoy my new doll. I designed her after Kanani, I basically, my dream doll is Kanani but with freckles, so that's where I kind of got the inspiration for this doll. Alright guys, well happy holidays, happy new year, take care, bye!